All right, good afternoon, you guys. It is Monday. We're on Hell Week. Yes. It's yes. gonna get really, really hot this week. So we have a little way for you to cool off that tastes good and it's kind of fun. Yes. And this is Erin Swan. Hi. She's a new sponsor of our show and she's gonna help us all get our credit in order. <laughs> and finances and budgeting. So she's a credit counselor and she and I have been talking on the phone trying to get this thing working. And she, she is, what you're gonna love about her when we talk to her is she's not just some guru of finance. This woman's been through it. So she's real, she knows it, and that's why she's on Get Real with Rick Dancer. Now, if you look behind us, you will see the Shave Ice booth over, we're in Oakmont Park, and Kelly's a friend of yours. Who, tell her who owns this. Uh, so Kelly Pruz owns it, and uh, she's got it for her kids to have a job, so it's awesome. They work um, and do the shave ice and provide uh, cool treats for people on hot days. So. Kelly started this um, two years ago, I think it was, and this is the little booth. It's over here off of Oakmont at the little Oakmont Park. So you guys having you guys having shaved ice? We're live, just so you know, okay? What do you like? So do you bring your kids here? This is our first time. This is your first time. So why shave ice? Uh, she saw it and she's like, I have to try it. So <laughs> There's like, something okay. about a snow. We had snow cones when I was a oh, kid. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Now so, it's kind yeah. of this Hawaiian <laughs> thing like that. So, Kelly, come here. Oh, wow, we got noise going on That's in the background. Beautiful. So, this is Kelly Perus. She, Hi there. She is the uh, one of the owners. Uh, the owner, yes. Her husband With is the other husband, owner. Yes. <laughs> and your yes, kids. Yes. So, you wanted your kids to have a summer job, so you bought them one. <laughs> That's right. That's exactly right. So it's your visit, but you're a financial planner, but this is just your side gig for your kids. Yeah, some people sell leggings and lipsticks and uh, lotions, and we sell shave ice on the side. So why is it called shave ice and not shaved ice? Well, think about shaved ice is past tense, and shave is being present and in the moment. So, so this is active. fresh Oregon shave fresh. ice. It's nothing nothing old about it. Exactly. And so, so can you take us in the back? Sure. Come in. These are the kids. Oh, hold on. We'll show you. Hi. Say hello to everybody. Hi. So this is your summer job. Your mom puts you to work yes. by buying you a snow, a, a shave ice <laughs> Yes, place. she did. Boy, she's a nice lady, isn't yeah, she? Yeah, it's, it's a really fun job. I love it. Yeah, I'm the main sweet bae. <laughs> <laughs> and that's the boy, huh? That's yeah. the son. Yeah, that's Shane. Okay, so hold on. Open that back door, will you? You guys were at the uh, Oakmont Park. I'm coming in. All right. I'm coming in. There's only a little bit of room. That's okay. I can squeeze. Okay, hold on. <laughs> I'm turning it around. Come on. Turn the camera around. There we go. Look at all these flavors. Okay, so wait, hold on, hold on. Okay, show me what you're doing. Oh, you guys, it's going to be 108 on Thursday. So no sitting around in your air conditioning. This is the way to cool off, right? Oh, my gosh. You want to try it, Jennifer? You can. Christina, this is where you need to bring the kids today. <laughs> it's Shave Eyes at Oakmont Park. Okay, so, come here, dude. So what's the, oh, you are so cool with your glasses. So what's the secret here? So the secret is to actually have the ice shaved, not crushed. That's what makes the shave ice, because it actually melts in your mouth. It just doesn't, you don't have to bite it, it just melts. So you do that? Can you show me how it works? Yeah. I, I know. You know. Why don't you just make me a little one? Ooh. Can what you? flavors are you getting? I don't know. What are you Noise in the Jenny Ranch says, love the place, always get great service. Aw, that's good to hear. There's the ice, always frozen. I think that's cool that your mom buys you a job. I have too many kiddos. <laughs> oh, yeah. Just looking at this. <laughs> yeah, there's kind of an art to this, isn't there? Oh, yeah. Okay. All right, now flavors. What do I have here? And then they're all hand formed. Oh, look at you. You're quite the little artist, aren't you? Oh, look at you. How old are you? Twelve. Twelve, and you have a summer job? Yeah. What are you going to be when you grow up? Uh, electrical or uh, robotic engineer. A robotic engineer. Okay, yeah. so this is where you got your start. Oh, bees are kind of a, a problem here, huh? Oh yeah. Okay, so um, so what? Can I have the the blackberry? Yeah. Look, we even have dye free. Yes, and sugar free options. Do you have sugar free? Where? Yeah. I'll do that. Yeah. Oh, let's try that. Are you okay. want your sugar free blackberry? Yeah, sugar free blackberry. All right. Oh my gosh, sugar free. It's stevia and not Splenda or Aspartame. It's stevia. Oh wow. 
Yeah. You guys, this is health food. Kinda. <laughs> kinda, Aaron. Kinda, <laughs> sorta. Aaron, I will share with you. Okay, hold on. Show me the, I gotta see the technique. Okay, go for it. Dude, you are the, oh my gosh, look at that. You guys getting one? I think Sophia's going to get one. Are you with her? You came to pick her up? Well, guess what? Now you're on Facebook Live, so you have no choice. There you go. Yeah, wait. Come on. Do something. Do, don't right. just stand there. You've got to do something. What are you getting? Matthew's from Vince. French. We're from France. You're from France? Oh, yeah. yeah. French. Okay. Thanks, buddy. Okay. Aaron? Want, Matthew? Aaron, I'm coming out. What? All right. Come here, Aaron. Okay. All right. Turn this around. Okay, hold on guys, look, there it is. That is the way to cool off in the summer. We're at Shave Ice, which is at the... Oakmont. Oakmont Park. Park. And, and you know what, Kelly, can you grab me another spoon? Oh, oh. Hello. No, Rod, I'm not gonna get a brain freeze. Rod is telling us, get a brain freeze. Okay, ready? We're like, it kind of feels like we're like on a little summer. Yeah, cooling down already. Isn't that good? And that's, you guys, this, they, so they have sugar-free and regular options. It was at the Oakmont Park, which is right behind Trader Joe's at the Oakway Center there. Um, and the best part is, I mean, what a great, I mean, actually, I didn't even think about this. Um, financial planning wise, yeah. what a great thing to do for your kids. So Kelly starts a business. Um, her kids now are getting some money, yeah. raising some money, and she has a business that just comes during the summer, which is kind of a great thing, you know? Yeah, it's great to get the kids started, get them to learn what money is and how hard it is to earn it, and maybe they'll spend it a little bit better. So you guys, Erin is, Erin um, Swan, she's with Easy Credit Consulting. She's a new uh, sponsor of ours. And what she does is uh, she sits down with you and helps you get your credit back to where it could be because all of us have issues at one time or another. And what I love about her is she started with an issue. So kind of explain that to them. So when I was about 23 or 24, I bought a house, I had a couple cars, I got in a little more from my head than I probably should have. And I had a file bankruptcy. Um, super embarrassing, not fun. And uh, a few years later, I met a girl who said that her okay, boyfriend had credit repair. And I was like, we what the heck is credit repair? So that you I repair credit? I never heard credit. of it. No, I hadn't either until and, that you called me. Yeah, and I'd been in finance for a while. Um, I, you know, car loans, mortgages, and things like that. And so I said, well, might as well try. I can't get any worse. And it worked. And so I learned more. And I started doing it to help friends and family, and it kind of turned into a job, and I love it. We help people all the time clean up their credit um, to buy houses and things like that to get over their past and not continue to be punished by those mistakes. What's the biggest thing that we are afraid to do? Is it really live in a budget? Yeah. Yeah, the B word. Nobody likes the B word. They hate it. But really, if they had an actual real budget, not a list of bills every month, paying your rent, and those kind of things. That's not a budget. You gotta budget everything. Um, they don't like it, they feel restricted, and they don't wanna do it. But really, that is where freedom comes in, is having a budget, a real one. So you sit down, and you and you guys, what I love about Erin is she's kind of a hard ass. Yes, <laughs> I mean, you're kind so. of hardcore. <laughs> when people come in and they're starting to work with her, it's like she was telling me about a client, we won't use any names or anything, but a client that wanted to purchase something special, and she said, no, you can't, you can't, you don't, you're signed up with me, you're gonna get this done before you get to get your car. And they actually got their car. Yeah, yeah, a client with a car. We had another client who was an attorney here in town and we helped him uh, be able to get a mortgage, two mortgages actually, and a car. He couldn't get an auto loan and after a few months we were able to get him a new used car for like 3%. Um, and he called me first and said, I wanna buy a new car. And I said, why? He said, because he wanted a new one. And I told him if it ran, he couldn't buy a new one. And so he kept it until it broke. And he called me and sent me the repair bill, a uh, repair estimate and the tow truck uh, bill. And I said, right, let's do this. And he got a new car. So you really get in there. Rod Oakway, Oakmont Park is right behind Trader Joe's, that little park on the other side of Trader Joe's behind uh, Oakway Center. That's where this is located. So you really sit down with people and you become part of their life. Yeah, yeah, people, we will only work with people who are serious. If you um, kind of willy-nilly, just kind of want to get by, we won't do it. It's a lot of our time, a lot of our effort. We want people to be successful in life. We want to teach them these things that should be taught in school um, or by their parents, but they just don't know either because they weren't taught. We want to teach them those so they can teach their kids. And what I also like about Aaron is there's no guilt. Um, you guys, we all make mistakes. And I think one of the hardest things for people to do is to go in and admit to you 
Yeah. I don't know what I'm doing and I'm wasting my money away and I've gone bankrupt. Who wants to tell people you've gone bankrupt? But it happens to a lot of people and especially now a lot more people. Correct. So you've created a business out of... <laughs> yeah, yeah, accountability is huge. We make people have accountability and we let them know there's no judgment. Um, I work both my sisters, which can be fun at times and not at others. And um, we've all had credit issues. Like everybody out there who's had them, um, if they haven't or say they haven't, they're liars. Everybody's had credit issues and where there's no judgment. We just want to help them learn why that happened and um, help them so it doesn't happen again. And so you guys, how do they get a hold of Easy? So it's Easy Credit Consulting. Their Facebook page is up at the top. You can find them. But how else can they get a hold of you with a phone number? Yeah, our phone number is 255-2044, uh, and we are located off of Q Street. So in Springfield off of Q Street, and um, you can sit down. They can get a cons consultation with you, and that doesn't cost them anything, Yep, a 15-minute right? consultation for free, and we'll talk about things and see where you're at, help you get a copy of your credit report, and see what's going on. Erin um, and her sister are definitely tell it like it is and hard workers. So glad to see you showcasing her today. Suzanne Holler? Yep. You know? Thanks, Suzanne. <laughs> Suzanne, <I'm not> <laughs> Suzanne, if you would take this and pass it on, that would be really great. Because what we, the thing you can really do to help Kelly, what we're trying to do is help local business, and we're sponsor. They sponsor this show, and then we want you guys to take it and spread it on your page. So if you would share this on your page right now, that's really awesome. Because then, yeah, I mean, honestly, no one really knows when someone near them <clears throat> may actually be having a problem. And yeah. And they're not going to come out to you and say, hey, I'm going bankrupt, you know. And um, so it might be somebody on your page that can be helped uh, by this. And um, Albert says, so important to live on a budget. It really is. And it's not, once you've kicked their butt for a couple of months, they get used to it, don't they? Yeah. Yeah. Once they have that accountability and, you know, no BS, you know, they say, well, this happened and that happened. The truth is they just didn't do what they were supposed to do. So if people want to work with us, they got to do what they're supposed to do. We do what we tell you we're going to do. So you need to do the same. Um, so yeah, we help people and then they love it and they always thank us. We have several clients that have purchased homes, their first home or a second or third home after bankruptcy um, and it feels great to help people. So you really do get them back on track? We do get them back on track, absolutely. Absolutely. All right, let's go find out more. Did you eat that? That is so I good. You guys, these are really good. So we're at Oakmont Park, right behind the Oakway Center, right behind Trader Joe's. I can see Bed Bath & Beyond from here. And this is Kelly Pruse. She purchased this two years ago. Uh, it's a shave ice, and it's for her kids to have a summer job. So if you want your kids to have a summer job, you can just go buy the thing for her. Yeah, we put my five-year-old niece to work. She has a lemonade stand in front of her office when she comes to visit. She made 15 bucks the other day, so we start him young. <laughs> <laughs> so she doesn't always do financial planning. She's trying to get people educated. It'd be really nice to get what you do in the public schools because we really don't teach that. Nothing against, I'm not slamming public schools, but that hasn't been a priority in our school system. We're actually working on a program, um, a module type program where we can teach the instructors. They have a version wow. and then they can do it for the kids as well. That's and we're probably going to start it. We live in Crestwell, so um, we'll probably try to start it there since we'll probably finagle our way in there um, and then work it out elsewhere. So again, this is Aaron Swan, Easy Credit Consulting, easy as in E and then a Z, not easy, E-A-S-Y, because there's nothing easy about this. <laughs> it's easy for her, but you're going to have to put some work in. But it, to be financially stable, it changes stress, it changes everything for you, doesn't yeah, it? Yeah, you actually save more money by having better credit. Um, you know, you pay higher interest rates on auto insurance. People don't know that. So you have bad credit, you're paying more for auto insurance. You can get your credit cleaned up, and even during the term in the middle of your policy, ask your agent to like refresh it, and you can get lower rates and premiums if your credit's been cleaned up. So yeah, for sure, um, having better credit saves you money. And you don't have that feeling like somebody's going to come get me. Uh, yes. you, know, you take ownership of your life again. You do, and knowing that if you need credit, um, that it's available. Nothing feels worse than needing it and not being able to get it. So, Bill, the shaved ice is down here. It does sound good, and it is amazing today. So come on down to the Oakmont Park right behind uh, Oakway Center and behind Trader Joe's. Okay, so let's go find out more about this. Okay. Little... It is really good. And you guys, just so you know, they have regular and stevia. Oh, look at the cute kids. Oh, my. So are you getting some shaved ice? Look at that. You're right there on Facebook Live. So hundreds of hundreds of people are seeing you. What flavor did you get? Uh, pomegranate. Pomegranate? <laughs> you said that really well. Is that good on a hot day? What's your name? All right, and then what's your zip code? The name from the Did you have to ask your mom your name? Yeah. Yeah, did she tell you? You don't remember? 
Okay. <laughs> okay. So you're, you're, you're getting shaved eyes. Uh -huh. you're, you're live, just so you know. So you're oh, live okay. on, on Facebook. Hi. So who's this? This is Max. Hi, Max. Has Max ever had shaved ice? Oh, <laughs> has Max ever had shaved ice before? No, he hasn't. This is more of a treat for Mama. <laughs> oh, yeah. On a hot day, there's nothing better, yeah. huh? That's what you want. Is it not, do you guys live around here? Uh, south of Eugene, yeah. So you come over to this park? And, oh, yeah. It's a nice location. And, uh, and did you know this was here? Yeah. Oh, one, one other time. So, so, you're, uh, so you're, you're a regular, semi-regular? Semi. Okay, 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 good. So... Oh my gosh, no. I'm sorry, we don't service certain people. What? Uh oh, there's Monique. Monique goes to my, well, she works at my gym and she allows me to go there. So she's my friend and her daughter. So you guys live over here? Yeah. Oh, do you? So do you guys come here often? No, it's our first time. Really? They have stevia shaved ice flavors and they have regular sugar flavors. Are you trying to tell me I need to eat good? Huh? Are you trying to tell me I need to eat good? Yeah, it's really good. It's really good, trust me. Morgan can't know I'm here. <laughs> we can't, we can't, we can't tell her trainer at the gym that she's here. She's getting the stevia one, Morgan, right? Yeah, yeah, she is. Is this your boy? It is. Yeah, I know. Yeah, it is. Oh gosh, no, don't put me on there. I know your dad. You have to. So okay, let's go find out for him. Hey, Kelly, come here for a second. Hello. <laughs> okay, so this is the owner, one of the owners. Yes. So I think it's pretty cool that you. Uh, to put your kids to work, you buy them a job. <laughs> yeah, right? I don't know if it's smart or what, but we how did. did. How did you decide on Shave Eyes, though? Well, uh, because they're, you know, there the really demand was there, there is, but they mostly do festivals and stuff, but there is no place that you can actually go on a day-to-day -day basis in Eugene Springfield to, to get Shave Eyes. So we saw the need, we saw the demand, and uh, we said, hey, let's do it. Let's make it happen. Okay. Hey, um... A guy on here, will you go back? Um, here's, here, here's Aaron. Rodmaster just said, I want to talk to that young lady, which she really appreciates, actually. <laughs> and just talk to her. I want to get some assistance. Please contact Rodmaster. So you'll, you'll get a hold of him. Uh, yep, she'll, sure. Rod, she'll find you. Um, also, give him the number one more time. It's 255-2044. And if you want to call now, my sisters are there, and they can help you as well. So, Rod, they'll get you an appointment set up, and she can sit down and talk with you for 15 minutes for nothing just to kind of see where you're at and go. So, yeah, that's nice. Yeah, I, you know, I think what I really like, um, Aaron, is I think I, that having you on the show for six months is going to give people hope. I hope because so. That's what I hope it does. I don't want people to feel bad. I just want them to feel like they have control of their life again. And I think finance is one of those is one of the areas that yeah. we get ripped off. You know, we rip ourselves off. Yeah, everybody just kind of bury their head hoping it'll get better, but it gets worse. And we do. We want to give hope. We want to let people know that um, you don't have to stay in your situation, that it can be fixed. It can be changed. There's lots of different ways. Yeah, you're good at this. Try. She's going to be here for at least six months. I think it's going to be really fun. We'll, and next month, um, she's going to come with me to the Scandinavian Festival. So we're going to go on a budget. Yes. She's going to make me go to the Scandi Festival on a budget. Yep. Does beer count? Uh, yep. you got to spend money for it unless they're going to give it to you for free. PBR. <laughs> she's gonna make me have pbr at the at the scandy fest yes <laughs> okay okay where's it? oh my god we're getting quite the line here so check this out folks so again there you are we are at shave ice sweet bay shave ice and it's a little stand a little cute little trailer right behind at the oakway park behind the oakway center in eugene where did kelly go kelly come here Kelly, darling. Kelly Pruse, would you please come to the front desk, please? Kelly Pruse to the front desk. Okay, let's put your sign in the back. So tell me, one last time, you're here for how long? When are you here? What days? We're here every day from 12 to 7. And yep. that's through the summer? Through, through the summer, except for August 21st. We're going to be uh, not open that day for the eclipse. But other days, are somebody here all the time. Mm -hmm. So you yep. have other, how many employees do you have here? Uh, we have up to 10. Okay, yep. all right, cool. All we right. do festivals, but always check our Facebook page before 10 a.m. because we do updates. Like today, we've got a little bit of a bee-friendly bee population, so uh, we're hoping that through the month of August, August, that uh, the bees will... Yeah, so just always check in with us to make sure that our schedule's on, but 12 to 7 every day. Okay, so go on, and I found them really easy. So you just go on there and you find Sweet Bay Shave Ice. There's no D, Shave Ice, because remember, this is fresh. This is local. This is Oregon. And um, Aaron, so we'll be back. Yes. Um, 
We love Aaron. Oh, Christina. Oh, oh yeah. Christy. That's because you take care of her kids. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we found that out, Christy. We were talking one day and she goes, oh, guess what? I know somebody you know. And then when she told me it was you, I went, no. no he I almost said we couldn't be friends anymore. I, I said, I'm not, I can't take you on as a client. I'm sorry. <laughs> you have bad friends. No, Christy's like my, I'm her uncle. She calls uncle me. Rick. Yeah, she calls me Uncle Rick when I'm not that old. I'm only old enough to be her very mature brother. So yeah. Rod has Eugene Gateways, getaways.com is his email there. So okay, perfect. There. All right, you guys. So thank you for being with us today. And again, Aaron with EZ Credit Consulting. And you can find him on Facebook. You can find him online. Her phone number's on here. Hey, Christina, would you put the phone number on here for um, for um, Aaron? Give it Not to my cell number. Not 255 2044. 541 255 2014. No, 2044. 2044. It so must Christi be that age. It is. <laughs> so, Christina, would you throw that on there for her so people will know how to get a hold of her? And again, stop by the, the Sweet Bay Shave Ice off of Oakmont Park. Uh, you're going to need it over the next few days. Did she get that right yes. on there? Yes. Uh, 255. Yep. Thanks, Chrissy. All right. Thanks, Chrissy. All right, you guys. So this is the place to be on a hot summer day. And by Thursday, you are going to want to hang out here for the whole entire afternoon. So um, stay cool. And uh, we'll be back on, we're going to be later this week. I got to think about what day it is. I think it's Thursday night. We're going to be at the Coburg. They're starting a series of music in the park in Coburg on Thursday, I think it is, and I will get back to you later about that. But we're gonna be doing a special from there in the evening, so a 5.30 show. And then on Friday, or Saturday, we're gonna be at the Coburg Car Show. They're having an old car show that we're gonna be at, so uh, you'll be sure to join us in that one. And if something fills in during the week, you'll see me here as well. All right, we'll talk to you guys later. Have a good day, and thank you for joining us. I'll see you this week.